Ladies and gentlemen, we finally got it. We were not gonna waste time opening up this box because you don't need to see hairy gorilla man hands opening up a box. We're gonna dive right on into this. Be sure to smash the other living boo boo stain off that like and subscribe button as we climb even higher the 1400 ladder and climb even closer to getting our briefcase. This thing is huge. I've been waiting all freaking day to open this thing. I was actually kind of curious about when it was gonna come in because I didn't get an email or anything about it, but lo and behold, yes, this thing is heavy and it is large. Oh my God. This is the Kaiba briefcase, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go ahead and pop this baby open if we move this out of the way. It's actually packaged really nicely. Very well made. If you saw on the OCG, they got this a long time ago. And we're just now getting it. This and this. Oh, that is sideways. That is not good. And ladies and gentlemen, talk about a money shot of... Kaiba's briefcase. I think I actually have the briefcase upside down, but we of course have the beautiful quarter century blue eyes, white dragon. And not only that, but also lo and behold, oh, well, I think these are just the dividers. We have, if I can find it here. Aha. Yes, this is what we want. We have the beautiful, look at that. Blue Eyes, White Dragons, in the Dark Dual Stories foiling. That is absolutely beautiful. Oh. It doesn't look like that they kept the, the vanilla look from back in the day, but let's go ahead and transition and get ourselves a better view. Oh, this might have to take the place of the Ultra Ball, ladies and gentlemen. I mean, this is just flat out gorgeous. I really hope that uh, my camera is doing it justice. This was worth every single penny. Oh, I really wish, I mean, maybe it's just the light that it's in, but I really wish that they would have stuck with the original like vanilla art style instead of it having being bright. Like, you know how like some vanilla monsters have like a darker tinge to them. And also we of course have the quarter century blue eyes white dragon and i don't think i'm gonna open this yet um it's it's so damn cool it's so cool and i mean as much as i want to look at these cards like life shaver and everything else uh, this has so much jesus this has so much girth to it like i'm i feel like i need to wash my hands after touching it like this is absolutely insane and it's definitely going to be an amazing 25th anniversary centerpiece for my gaming collection setup. But to discuss more about this unboxing, I'm, I'm still in shock with how beautiful these fucking cards are. <laughs> Honestly, like, it's finally here. And, like, we also have the God cards coming. And I'm, it's so exciting. It's so cool. Uh, is this a good investment, though, at the end of the day? Look, if you have $500 to blow on a 25th anniversary collector's piece, this is going to be something you're going to want. And on top of that too, I mean, the briefcase can be used to like store your cards. Like I've been using shoe boxes for over a decade. I can pretty much get rid of those shoe boxes now and just use the the giant Kaiba briefcase, even though it's like 20 pounds. But I mean, I'm not gonna be carrying that to a, an event like, that's just not going to happen. But, God, if you have the money for this, this is such a beautiful piece. They don't have set IDs. They're legal cards to play. I don't know why you would ever do this to yourself and play these. But, I mean, they're just incredible. And to show you the back here, you're probably getting a massive reflection. But... I don't know why you'd ever play these, but you can unscrew these. You can play these. You can touch these. I don't know why you would, but you can. Um, I've talked about, uh, well, rather, I've seen some people talk about, like, getting these graded. Um, sure, you do you, Sugar Boo Bear. I'm not in the grading world. I don't know why you want to get these graded. 
I would imagine they'd probably get like nines through PST or something like that. Uh, or PGA, whatever the fuck the name is. But I'm sorry, I can't take my eyes off these beautiful things. I feel like I just swiped right on a beautiful girl on like Tinder or something. <laughs> um, but I'm really glad that I bought this. Like I'm, I'm just flabbergasted at how beautiful of a piece it is and how much value this is going to have years to come. I mean, let's say five years down the road, a sealed Kaiba deck out of this $500 briefcase is worth, you know, a thousand bucks on its own, which is going to be interesting to see how are they going to reprint like attack guidance armor and magical trick mirror and all that, like in the actual game, like, are they just going to dump it into like terminal revenge or something like that to put these cards out to the masses? Cause right now, like if you want to play attack guidance armor, basically all of us who have the briefcases can set the price. Like we can say, okay, it's a hundred dollars for attack guidance armor. Cause the only way you're getting it is through this deck which again, I'm not going to open, at least for right now. But it's definitely a beautiful piece. That briefcase is heavy as hell. Um, I'm going to go put the dividers in it. I'm going to take a picture. Be sure, again, that you're subscribed and have notifications turned on uh, because I'm going to be taking a picture of it in my gaming setup. It is a bit heavy and it's glass, so I don't know if I should have it in my gaming setup with like, you know, my whole like shrine of gaming and stuff like that. I think I've taken a picture for the channel before, but if not, I'm going to hopefully have a picture up with these beautiful cards. Um, and so I can add it, you know, to the collection and the God cards. If you think about it, the God cards are going to basically be coming in the same thing, except they were 400. Um, I don't know where I'm going to put that. Actually, I'm going to have to figure that out. But like, if you've got the money for these 25th anniversary pieces, you have got to swipe these things up. And remember too, that this Kaiba deck is all ultra rares minus the quarter century blue eyes and it's OCG artwork. So you're getting the OCG uh, card art from Monster Reborn. You're getting an ultra rare blue eyes ultimate dragon. You're getting all these nice things. Again, attack guidance, armor, magical trick mirror, life shaver. Like these cards are garbage. Don't get me wrong, but it's cool to have them in the actual game, especially for magical trick mirror being obelisk support. But again, those cards are garbage for a reason. So Konami, you outdid yourself. I'm, I'm still shocked at how beautiful these cards are. I feel like I need to go wash my hands. Like, I'm sorry to make it sound like I'm being a blowhard for this, but it's, it's so nice. It's so nice. And I don't even know if my iPhone camera is doing it justice. But guys, thanks for watching. Really appreciate all the love and support. And I finally got the heart monitor. I'm not going to show it on my chest. You can maybe through it, see it through my shirt a little bit. Um, or else I'll, this video will easily get demonetized. Um, but I look like I just ran out of a house fire because they had to shave my chest. So I've got all these patches. Yeah. So we tied in a health update to this video. But guys... Thanks for watching. I love you very much. And I'll speak with you again very, very soon. I got to go wash my hands after touching these beautiful cards. <laughs>